on a cinder block in Superior. Scars are beginning to heal. Our house used to be right here. Sandy and Jim. Nothing left. Completely wiped out. Judy. Yeah, so we're standing in our driveway, our former driveway. Lori and Brent. That's our space, uh, and they finally start digging for the foundation. Ed and Nancy. We all banded together, and we've stayed together as a group. And Eric and Leslie are neighbors. The Marshall Fire brought them together as survivors. There were eight homes that burned. Four on this side, our house to the corner, and four on the other side. The Great Eight, as they call themselves. It caught on, and we seem to enjoy that status. Came together Tuesday. Yeah, the Great Eight. To put on construction hats <laughs> and break ground. No, oh, there's a rock. On their new homes. We can't wait till it's done. Yeah. Absolutely. The neighbors all moved in at the same time when the subdivision was built five years ago. They chose to rebuild together with the same builder who gave them a home the first time around. Remington came forward and said, we'd be happy to help you rebuild what you had before. We are going to be starting construction this week on all eight. On a cinder block in Superior, the grade eight build back their neighborhood. It's special. It is. Love the neighbors. Couldn't ask for better neighbors. Couldn't have gotten through this without them. There were more than 50 homes in the neighborhood where these folks live in Superior. Theirs were the only eight that burned down. After more than a year and a half of dealing with insurance and cleaning up debris today, everyone had a smile on their face celebrating the champagne well deserved for a positive change after so much negative. Yeah, but here you are thinking the great eight, nearly eight months later, and yeah. you're still looking at a more, another eight months, maybe eight, 10. Eight months, 10 months, a year before all this will be done with all the building shortages, the staff shortages, it could be still a long time until they're actually able to move in, but and, still positive. And these eight are near the front of the line compared yeah. to a lot of their neighbors. There are a lot of people that are going to be waiting a lot longer for even starting rebuilding. Mm -hmm. so, all right. Yeah. Mark, thank you.